Hello everyone, this is Joda. I'm doing uh, my colour correction tutorial, what people have been asking for. So first of all, I pan and crop. As you can see, I've already done that. Then I go down to uh, properties, disable resample and maintain aspect ratio. We get untick that and uh, tick disable resample. Okay. First of all, colour corrector. That sh and then I click on the studio RGB to computer RGB I just drag that on like that I, and then I don't alter anything I just drag that on then I go down to sharpen just reset to none that's it, it just brings the quality out a lot better as you can see just then quality just instantly got better then uh, my saturation adjust I've already got a preset for this but I'll re I will read out my settings for you all and then I'll, I will put them in the description as well because I know it will be hard to be seen in the video uh, the amount is on full it's one the center is on 0 0.2580 the spread is on 0 0.5060 and the low it, it varies really I, I change it from time to time because as you can see there like it brings it brings out the colours great on certain things on the on the bright coloured things, and then it dimmers the whole background. Uh, like if you turn it down a bit, it makes the whole thing grey. But if you turn it up, it just it brings out a few more colours than that. But so I normally have it on around minus minus 0 0.7500 500, and then but if that's not right, you can always alter it. And the high should be on one, which is full. So uh, I hope you enjoy anyway, I will leave all the settings in the description because I know it will be hard to follow from from the video. Uh, if you could, I will I will put this clip in at the end so you can see like how effective it is. And it's all, this colour correction is also on my last gameplay, it's, it's called gameplay number 2. It's, that's on Call of Duty 4 as well where I get 10 kills. So I hope you enjoyed and if you could all give me a thumbs up that would be great, thanks.